Good afternoon, everybody. This is the daily video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. I am Oscar Sinclair. Today is Good Friday in the Christian tradition. And in the architecture of holy time, Good Friday is a kind of hollow nave somewhere in between the ground on which we walk and the heights of our hope. Liturgically, it marks the day when Jesus of Nazareth, Nazareth was crucified. Easter celebrates his resurrection. It is a day of hope, of joy, and new and changed life bursting into being. But none of that happens before the death. The empty tomb means so much because it is expected, unexpected because somebody was buried there and then disappears. You cannot have Easter without Good Friday. Joy and sorrow in this life are inseparable. And 2020 is not a year where we have to overemphasize that grief, fear, and loss are a part of life. Surely we all can connect with that right now but it is good to connect with it, to be honest about it, so that when hope and joy come, they will be real, anchored in our lives and our lived experience. So on this Good Friday, I want to close with a poem by Edna St. Vincent Millay. I am not so resigned to the shutting away of loving hearts in the hard ground. So it is, and so it will be, for so it has been, time out of mind. Into the darkness they go, the wise and the lovely, crowned with lilies and laurel they go. But I am not resigned. Lovers and thinkers into the earth with you, be one with the dull, the indiscriminate dust, a fragment of what you felt, of what you knew, a formula, a phrase remains, but the best is lost. The answers, quick and keen, the honest look, the laughter, the love, they are gone. They are gone to feed the roses. Elegant and curled is the blossom, fragrant is the blossom, I know, but I do not approve. More precious was the light in your eyes than all the roses in the world. Down, down, down into the darkness of the grave, gently they go the beautiful, the tender, the kind. Quietly they go, the intelligent, the witty, the brave, I know. But I do not approve, and I am not resigned. <laughs>